All right, guys, in this video, I'm going to show you how to add phone numbers to your phone number list by using our import feature. All right, and there's a multiple, uh, few different ways to get to the import option. You can uh, click here to import numbers to specific lists. And to get to my list, obviously, you come here to SMS, list management, my list, or you can add a new list. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and go into an actual list. So you can see where you can get that template file and here where it says import phone numbers this is where you can use our import file to import numbers to get to the file you click on the question mark icon here on the right you download our file and then just open it up with excel i have our file already open and you can see it's very very simple you have the phone number and everything else is blank all right, to add additional fields to your phone number list, you can add them here on the right. So I'll do name, uh, then I'll do last name, and we can do city, for example, if you have all of this information. And here you can start typing your phone number. So I'll do 305, well, I'll do plus one, which is the US country code. Make sure you add your country codes as well. 305-888-8888. Uh, we'll do plus one and do three zero five seven 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 seven. We'll do plus one uh, seven eight six eight 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 eight. We'll do plus one, which and then we'll do nine zero one eight seven 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 seven. Let's do that. We'll do name, John, uh, we'll do Josh, Doe, John, Doe, Mike, Doe, and Alex, Doe. Uh, city, we'll do Miami, 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 all right? And then from here, I'll just click Command S or Control S on a PC to save that file and it is taking some time to save boom there it just saved come back in here choose the file and you can add as many custom fields on that chart as you'd like all right so let me see where i saved this file what's the name of the file uh phone numbers all right let's see where i saved this file here open it click save and there you go. Your changes were saved successfully. Five phone numbers were added with three different fields, which is exactly what I did. Let's confirm that. So there we go. Well, I had four. I had one phone number already in there. Um, so there's four phone numbers here. And we have uh, three different uh, fields, which is uh, name, last name, and city. All right. So that's as simple as it is to uh, import phone numbers to your list, but you have to ensure, again, you have to ensure that you use our file. And you can see here, I have the city, I have last name, and I have the name. And now anytime that I go ahead and um, create a campaign for these people, I can come here to, uh, let's go ahead and do broadcast management, add broadcast. We'll do test. We'll do a webinar, that's the one I believe we just added. And you can see now the names show up. And as soon as I click on it, the field was copied to my uh, clipboard. I click paste, and now I'm able to use those custom fields in my text, okay? So uh, very, very powerful uh, importing feature and being able to customize the messages by uh, having those available fields. So thank you guys, and we'll go on to the next video.